Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to find and recover lost or unsaved Microsoft Excel files. And this would apply for other Office products as well. So, it's going to be a pretty straightforward tutorial and we're going to jump into it. So the first thing you want to do is open up the actual workbook that you might have had the promise that the files didn't save. And you want to go ahead and left click on the file tab up at the top left. And then you want to go down and left click on options. On the left side here, you want to left click on save. Where it says save auto recover information, you want to look for file location right here and there should be a path in here. This is the path in which any auto saved files are located in. So if you don't see anything in here, they're probably not going to be able to be recovered, I'm sorry to say. But we're going to navigate over to this. So I'm going to actually just open up my start menu here. I'm going to type in computer. Different ways, if you know how to find a path, you don't really have to keep watching at this point, but I'm just going to show it to everybody else. So I'm going to open up this PC. So open up File Explorer. i got this PC open here. It says it's under the C drive, so I'm going to double click on C. And I'm going to go underneath Users. And then I'm just, again, just following whatever path is listed here. I'm going to go MD Tech. And then if you don't see the app data folder, you might have to go and left click on view. And then go left click on options over on the right. Left click on the view tab right here. And underneath hidden files and folders, select show hidden files, folders, and drives. Left click on apply and OK. And now we have an app data folder that's semi-transparent, but we're going to open that up. Then you want to go under roaming and then Microsoft, and then Excel. And you're welcome to change its default save location as well. So once it's under here, if you had any saved files, they should be listed in here and you would be able to recover them hopefully. But again, if it's already too late, I would suggest going forward, make sure you see your set auto recover information every so many minutes. Set it to every minute or two. I don't think 10 minutes is of too much time, but it might not be frequent enough for most of you guys. Like I would personally hate going back and doing 10 minutes worth of work if I didn't think it was necessary. So you can actually really bump it down too if you want. So you go down to a minute. Um, you also can keep the last auto recover version if you close without saving. Recommend check marking in there. Keep that check marked if it already is. And you can change the file location as well if you'd rather save it to a folder on your desktop or something. You're more than welcome to. And once you're done doing that, just left click on OK. And that's pretty much it. So hopefully you guys were able to recover your lost Excel files. And as always, thank you for watching. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.